I am here to vlog Gretna versus Vale leaving. Vale leaving are uh, bottom of the league is a clash of the bottom two. Gretna are second bottom. And right now there's an important stat right now. It's an unbelievable stat to be honest. Vale leaving have played 16 games, conceded 99 goals. Here yeah, Gretna with the chairman of Gretna FC. Sun is shining, obviously. Three points is up for grabs today. Chairman doesn't look too happy. Maybe it's because <laughs> he knows his team's. It's a big game for the chairman. How are you doing today? Not bad, mate. It's a pressure game today, yeah. you know, for both teams. Mm -hmm. Obviously, um, everybody's wanting to win, but um, puts a little bit of pressure on the home side. But um, I'm sure we'll give them something today well, to see about. I'm hoping so. I'm hoping so. <laughs> um, so, a win today can kick start. A nice yeah, run? Yeah, hopefully we'll get a good win and um, that maybe kick us off for our next game. Yeah. Nothing. Well, I'll bet you a pie. <laughs> I'll bet right. you a pie and a pint that you right. win by three clear goals today. Right, you're on. You're on. We've got that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with Ian, who deals with all the social media for the club. Ian, how are you doing? You okay? Yeah, good. Sun good shining. Oh, <laughs> happy days. Bottom two clash. Yes. Um, how are you feeling about today's fixture? Um, well, we need a win. Yeah. Yeah, and then that will help the lads maybe relax for a bit for the rest of the season, you know, and to push on from here. But um, a lot of changes in Vale's setup, so mm -hmm. it's going to be a tough game once yeah, again. Here with Jill, the chairman's wife, aka the boss. <laughs> uh, she does everything, she deals with everything. Jill, how long have you been here? Uh, oh, it'll be probably about three years now. Three years now, yeah. three years. Three happy years? Very happy years. Ah. Yes, it's all good fun. Good. <laughs> what, what do you get up to? What time do you wake up? What time does your day start? <laughs> well, I'm usually up early in the morning, uh, pr probably up up about half past seven. Uh -huh. um, start to prepare for stuff to make sandwiches and that for the players. Got you. And then it's getting the pies, coming down, cooking the pies off, heating the ovens up. Um, generally, the hot dogs. Just I'm in the kitchen most yeah. of the morning, and then. Do you Pick eat? Up. Do you have breakfast for yourself though oh, before I, you go? I manage my breakfast. I never have breakfast till after six. So. <laughs> it's from breakfast till six, it's just uh, quite busy. Quite busy. Um, what pies is it we're looking forward to today oh, at half time? No, then the cracking pies. We've got steak pies, mm -hmm. which are from Kirkups at Longtown. The okay. beautiful pies, and we've got Scotch pies, which are from Cares Butchers at Gretna. So we like to support our local you know all our local businesses yep. so uh yeah they're both lovely pies so you'll have to have one of each you can't just have one i'll, I'll, I'll actually <laughs> just do that don't worry at all listen i'm not shy when it comes to food uh but yes um i'm with the gaffer of gretna mr steer hatfield how you doing how you feeling i'm good man how are you i'm not bad i'm not bad I'm not... home fixture today massive game um yep. bottom two teams so not the position we'd like to be in but it's uh -huh. where we find ourselves um and yeah, big opportunity. Both teams will be looking for the three points. And uh, yeah, must win, I would say, for probably both teams at this stage. What's your relationship with the chairman? Absolutely not. <laughs> I, I, I met the chairman for the first time four weeks ago. Uh -huh. <laughs> so that's, that's pretty much it. I, he's a great guy. I'm sure you spoke to him. And, uh, he's bubbly and he's positive and he wants to see this club doing well and yeah. back to where it should be. So essentially, um, all I can tell you is that in my experience, he's a great guy. And I sort of have to say that because he hired me, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> The so, two boys on loan from Morton. Aiden and Josh. Yeah, that's Aiden and Josh in there. Hi there, guys. I'm here with Josh and Aiden, the top goal scorers of Great FC. Guys, smile. It's all right. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> we'll start with you, sir. Uh, what's it like playing for Great now? Uh, it's been good to on loan from Morton. It's been good to get down and get get some games in the whole and league and just happy to be scoring a few goals. Three goals and stuff like that. What about yourself? Yeah, I'm on one as well. So, so who are you on one from? Uh, Martin as well. Martin as well. Oh, so uh, what is this? Dino uh, Jules? Uh, 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 <laughs> he's lived near each other as well? I uh, lost the Street feature. Is that how it is? Uh, oh, is that how it is? Uh, Not bad. So who's getting the sweeties and who's driving? Yeah, uh, well, usually he can drive, I'll get the sweeties. <laughs> <laughs> I see myself Perfect. Let's what about you, Mr. Quiet? <laughs> yeah. Are you just woken up? <laughs> Long journey. <laughs> That's, it's been good. Uh, obviously, getting goals, getting games, mm -hmm. assists, and that is going to help us in the long run. But playing in a in the long league against men, that's going to help us as well. We're still 18, 19. So. Eddie, one of the coaches here, getting ready, obviously for the warm up. Eddie, what are we expecting today? Hopefully, 
hopefully a positive performance and yeah. a good result. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Most important thing. Big game today though. It is obviously you know. we're not we're not proud and happy about the situation where we mm -hmm. are, but uh, yeah, we need to perform well today. These are the type of games we need to make sure we win. Yeah, Bobby, how are you doing, bro? Yeah, I'm good. I'm Bobby man. here. I'm with the Villain Lever new manager, Grant. Grant, how are you feeling? I'm good, Bobby. You're yeah, good. good. I'll, I'll ask you a new question. How was the, how was the trip up here? But I tried, but we got here. It was, to be fair, it was a nice drive. So decent, 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 through. decent. So obviously, new manager. How are you feeling? <coughs> Club, new manager. Good, aye. So our sort of first full week of training this week. Mm -hmm. uh, managed to get a few boys in, so we've got about eight in now. So what to Here with Stuart, the Mister Gretna FC. Stuart does basically everything for this team and the ground. Stuart, how are you? Fine, thank you. Yeah. So game day. What's a game day like? Hectic. Yep. Talk yeah. me through it. When you wake up, uh, probably start ten o'clock here, coming to prepare the ground, ready for the game. Mm -hmm. It's a lot better now when I've got no grass. Um, <laughs> but you know, it's even worse then because obviously you're rolling the park and getting everything ready. And if we've had we've had heavy overnight rain like we had last night, the lines yep. would have been washed off. So it would be pitch lines, nets. Back home again, have something to eat, and then come back again with hospitality and get ready for the game. That's where I come in the hospitality, and you're a good man, Stuart. <laughs> Stuart, obviously, you're home to Verleuven today. Um, I spoke to the manager, he's hopeful, he's confident. Um, obviously, it's his first home game, I believe. Um, what's your thoughts? Yeah, it's a difficult game, you know what I mean? They're fighting for the life, same as what we are, and mm -hmm. uh, it's going to be a, a really difficult game, you know, because I can see. You know, when they've arrived now, they're just a young side, same as us. So it's going to be even Stephen from that point of view. Energy, right? Yeah. So again, you know, like I'm looking forward to the game, mm -hmm. but it's it, it, it's a big ten point of this one today for us to get out of the the little rut we're in. Yeah. You know, I know it's a long way to go. Nobody in the club, anybody from top to bottom, mm -hmm. is talking about relegation. You know, it's yeah. we're only after today. I think that's just completed half the season. So. You know, I mean, you know, we've got another 17 games to go. The only way is up, though, is right? Exactly. So again, you know, with the young side, it took us a long time mm -hmm. to get them into the system. You know, obviously with a new manager coming in now, that's you know took its toll. But now they're all settled down, and hopefully we can kick on now and start from today. Started. How are you doing, guys? Yes, I'm here with some Van Leven players who have made the two-hour journey from Edinburgh. I'm with Sammy and I'm with Eusebio. Funny thing, fact, is that these two are actually my friends. Yeah. So a nice little surprise. <laughs> Very good football players, uh, especially when I play with them, they help me score loads of goals. But unfortunately, I'm not going to be on the pitch with them today, so they need to do that without me. <laughs> Sammy, I'm going to come to you. What are you thinking for today's game? Uh, we a tough game. Yeah. Uh, especially because, you know, we are a new team. Yeah. New players coming every week, so we have tough team for us, but we need to fight hard, stick in, and just. Yeah. Right. The same, my brother. So, uh, I, I, how, do you, how do you think today will go? I think it will go, it will go well for us. It's going to be a difficult game, but not impossible. Yeah. We come from far away, so we're going to do the things well. It's going to be positive, and obviously we're going to go for three points. Yeah, 100%. 100%. Uh, it's, it's a mind killer. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's that's um that's all that we're looking for for forward. Score, assist, do it well. Work for the team. It's the most important thing. It doesn't matter if I score or Sammy does score. Just three points, and we go back home happy. The home side, Gretna, just obviously getting a few touches for the ball. Also, I'm here at the game with a fan of Villain Leven, who actually is the wag of the player of Villain Leven, uh, Rebecca. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm okay, okay. So, um, besides your boyfriend playing, is there any reason why you're here? Goals. So are you going to be singing in the terraces? Uh, if there's other fans to help me, yeah. <laughs> also, I'm here at the game with a fan of Vale and Leven, who actually is the wag of the player of Vale and Leven. Uh, Rebecca, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm okay, okay. So um, besides your boyfriend playing, is there any reason why you're here? Uh, just like support, you know, give them the best of luck, help for some goals. So are you going to be singing in the terraces? Uh, if there's other fans to help me, yeah. <laughs> Good class! Gretna! Thank you! That's alright! We love Gretna! 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 We
they'll leave in. Do you think they can get the win today? I do believe so, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. 100 percent 100 What position does your partner play? Yeah, winger. Winger. Oh wow. So yeah. is he a speedy Gonzalez? Yeah, he's a bit speedy, yeah. yeah. Got some skills. Okay, can you keep up with him though? No. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm sitting in the dugout right now. Gretna FC obviously out, just you know, getting a touch of the ball and stuff. I can't help think though, you know, they must be smelling blood, you know, to be honest. Come on. Bill even have conceded 99 goals in 16 games. Come on. Listen, I'm thinking I might get my boots on. Do you know what I mean? Big job for that goalkeeper today. Gretna look young with energy, so I think that evens the game out. But personally for me, I think that we're going to have to see a really good game. Bill and even need to actually pick it up now. Grant, obviously new manager, Bounce. So we'll see what will happen, but hey. So I'm here in the ultras with the leader, the top boy, Daniel. Daniel, what does Gretna mean to you? Everything. Everything. Is this life? Is this life? How yeah. old are you, Daniel? Twelve. Twelve. So do you normally come see Gretna on a Saturday afternoon? Yeah. So is that the, the ultras there? Yep, the dogs of us. <laughs> What's the score prediction? Uh, three one Gretna. Three one Gretna? Yeah. Right. It's, it's mental, 100 goals in 17 games. Crazy, absolute crazy. But let's uh, one no Gretna. Aye. What are you thinking so far? Well, it's a tight game. They're both playing, they're both quite equal there. Yeah. Um, but Gretna took the chance and that's it. Uh, do, do you not think, obviously I watched the game, I think Gretna dominating possession, but they just seem to be naive with the yeah. last ball. With the last yeah, pass. Yeah, last pass. Aye. The boy Josh, number eight, scored. And you the way you close. Half time 1 1. I'm here with a Gretna fan, Cameron. Cameron 1 1. What's your thoughts on the first half? Shocking, absolutely shocking. Why do you say shocking? We're playing a team that's bottom of the league with minus 90 goal difference. 100, and, 95 then. 90, 95 minus 95. Yep. And you think Gretna haven't been great this season, but this is a must win game at the bottom of the table. Yeah. And the players aren't showing really any fight. I think we've got Sam and Nets who's playing well. Yeah. But otherwise, there's no way. Uh, it's, it's no it's, conviction. <laughs> Proper goal scramble here. Fans are a bit and do. One 
one, it's full time. One by one, full time. Gretna should have won. Gretna should have won. Had to post, did everything oh, except score. Mm. Really frustrating today. Was it first, was the result the frustrating part or was it the way you played? I think it was the way they played, they probably in the last third. Um, I think they did quite a lot. Mm -hmm. um, getting the ball through, it was a, the final ball from midfield yeah. to the forwards. It was a bit disappointing at times. Steve, what do you think? <sighs> Relieved to pick up the, the first point in, uh, in three league games. I think mm -hmm. it's been a while since uh, Gretna have came away from a league game not having lost. So yeah. that's a positive. Credit to Vela Leiden. They obviously have a lot of young players brought in. The new manager, they made it hard for us. They fought for every ball and certainly yeah. um, they'll feel as if they've come away with a well-earned point. Mm -hmm. um, we're disappointed with the goal, obviously, as you've seen. And, um, there's a little bit, a bit of naivety, as I spoke about at the start of the game. Yeah. Just the young lads maybe not switching on and taking advantage of. But to be honest, the second half performance was very encouraging. We sort of penned them in for the majority of the half. Mm -hmm. Created numerous chances. Um, just the lack of quality, really, in terms of a finish or... A uh, through ball or cross is what cost us in the end. Full time 1 1 here with the Villa Lever manager. Um, first of all, I'm going to congratulate you on your point. Thank I you. think it was hard, really. Been organised and hard to be, that's what the plan was. You yeah. know, it doesn't need to be pretty at the moment. We've mm -hmm. been shipping goals in left, right, and centre. So the, the first job we had was let's be organised, have a plan, be hard to beat, and then we can go and build on that. So we managed to come down here. Did I get wrong? I would have rather have had the three points. But yep. We managed to take the point and the work that the boys put into the game was unbelievable in terms of they never had a lot of the ball as much as we mm. would have liked of and especially in the second half but we just had to keep pressing, closing down spaces, You made the, the big mistakes. Yeah, exactly. They were making mistakes. Yeah. Oh. They've got belief now, eh? you yeah. can see how big and put a lift in them, they're, they're chirpy, they're happy because mm. they've got, like, I'm not, like I say, we're not going to celebrate a point. But they've earned it though. Yeah, they, they, they've They've earned something, they've got yep. points on board. Like I said in the change rooms at, half, at the end of the game, like I just said to yourself, you're going to get a first win now. That's, mm -hmm. a, that's the next task. So, In this league, if you're organised and you work hard, you give yourself an opportunity to get points against anybody. It's not just guys running around about us, we're going to try and take points in any game we can. 100%. But you heard it here first, guys, you make your own luck. <laughs> right, congrats again on the new job. Cheers, and I wish you all the best. Thank you very much. Take Cheers, mate. For right. today was just the final ball. Absolutely. The I mean, final ball. To be honest, um, the game started off really well for us. I just yeah, stretched them left to right, uh, through the channels, yeah. front to back. To be honest, it was looking really, really good. Created a few good chances and uh, a few set pieces and things. And I felt like we stopped that. So yeah, um, congratulations on scoring the 100th goal. <laughs> and um, I wish you luck against East Coast Bright next week. Thank you very much. Thank you. Guys, all the best. Have a